we are, we are soldiers of the light, and we will glow. Oh, 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 oh. Hey guys, it's been a while since my last video, but I thought I'd update you on what's happening this time around in Iron Banner. Um, okay. Everything's pretty much changed. Uh, I'm just going to make this video pretty short and sweet, but uh, basically Saladin no longer runs Iron Banner. Um, he's busy looking after Felwinter's Peak. Uh, got no idea why. There's loads of wolves around, loads of guardians around. Looks pretty safe to me. But any who, who is looking after Iron Banner, well, that would be Lady Ifridi. When you first start uh, Iron Banner this time around, you'll have a little short movie and you'll have a little waypoint showing you uh, where Lady Ephrodi is, um, which she's over not here, not hard to find. Um, but when you do meet her, she's she's got You're four bounties this time around. I've actually completed one of them already, so sorry about that. But they're pretty easy to do. There's, there's not uh, a great deal going on with these. Some of the previous ones used to be quite hard. But uh, to give you an idea, here they are. This this was after about three games, uh, three maybe four games worth of play. 55% um, through that one, 61% through that one, and 35% through that one. Um, as you can see, they're quite easy. And 100 points for playing Iron Banner. Each match completed equals 5 points, each match win equals 10 points. So at worst case scenario, you're going to be playing 20 games, but I'm sure you're going to win some throughout that, so you should complete that a lot earlier. Um, earn 100 points of ability kills at the Iron Banner. Uh, 2 for grenade, 3 for melee, 5 for a super kill. Um, again, you'll rack that up with uh, no problems at all. And earn 100 points of weapon kills at the Iron Banner. Okay, one point for a special kill, uh, sorry, two points for a special kill, one point for a primary kill, and five for a heavy kill. Um, as you can notice, all of these bounties um, give you 25 legendary marks, every single one of them when you hand them in. Uh, different bounties have different um, legendaries, that's a legendary weapon, uh, legendary armor, that's also a legendary weapon. Um, and they will give you 500 experience towards uh, your Iron Banner rep. Um, oh, I really can't remember the other one that I handed in, but basically it gave me the same um, 500, 5,000 experience and 750 Iron Banner reputation. Um, okay, this time round you haven't got the mechanic in place where if you play uh, throughout the week your Crucible uh, scores rank up, sorry, Crucible reputation ranks up after a win, that's gone. Uh, so also there's no point keeping these bounties till further in the week because you'll still only get your 750 reputation whether you hand it in as soon as it's completed or whether you hand it in at the end of the week. So there's no point holding on to those. Um, these weapons here as listed in the database are all 350. So you can buy these at 350 as soon as you re the, reach the relevant rank, which is rank 3 for the arms, rank 3 for the class item, and rank 4 and 5 um, for both the weapons. Uh, your first weapon is uh, the Proud Spire, which is a shotgun, mm, pretty poor range. Uh, well, actually got rifled barrel, oiled frame, snapshot, casket mag, replenish, and aiming this weapon, uh, rangefinder. Okay, your other weapon in the Iron Banner this time round is the Unbent Tree. Okay, um, pretty poor impact, but the rate of fire is literally maxed out, so you could expect that on the impact. Perks available is perfect balance, reinforced barrel, lightweight, casket mag, hidden hand, and hip fire. Uh, scopes are Iron Red Dot, Iron Warrior Sights, and Iron Ranged Scope. Uh, sorry, I've missed the scopes available for the Proud Spire, which is Linear Compensator, Accurized Ballistics, and Field Choke. 
Okay, the armor that you can get, or the weapons that you can get from the bounties themselves, can drop uh, above uh, 350. I think the database, uh, if you go to bungee.net into the armory, does list these weapons can drop as uh, high as 385. But depending on your light level, you could get these dropping maybe two, three points above your uh, current light. Um, light and peace go with you. Okay, the uh, every win that you uh, get in Iron Banner, you'll be rewarded with 250 rep uh, every single win. Uh, a loss gives you zero rep, but uh, you will get one of your Iron Medallions. Um, let's see if I've got any. Probably have. Uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, you can stack uh, as many as five of these, and on your next win, when you do turn them in, uh, you'll get 150 rep uh, for each one. Um, okay, I think that's probably about it this time round. Um, yeah. Okay. If we could get 300 million likes for this video, that would be pretty good. But uh, realistically, five or six would be pretty nice too. Okay, this has been Gaming Animal. Signing off.